My name is Jane Garland. I'm uh, a community councillor who has an interest in all of the project area, um, but also today the hat I'm wearing is for Rotary commoners um, who are landowners, farmers for the area that have rights on the common. Rudry Common is a rural common and it goes from the village of Rudry all the way down to Van Road. I've been involved uh, with the Sustaining Kapili Landscape Partnership project for from the beginning really. It was over six years ago. I went to the countryside team and said I, I would like to do something that involves looking after the land and the landscape but also bringing together a lots of different areas. Managing the common is something that we have to consider. Uh, we have to look at that in terms of the season, uh, also in terms of whether we manage it through traditional methods, so we've trialled traditional and modern methods. The projects allowed us to network and link in with other projects outside, so by bringing in contractors to be able to manage the land in the future for improvement of biodiversity and recovery of the, the, the local conservation here. My name's Dan Moody, I'm a farmer in Rudry. We're an off-grid small holding of 16 acres. We aim to be about 65% self-sufficient, totally off-grid, um, living off the land. The farm here, or our small holding here, got, we got links with uh, the Rudry commoners and um, with our approach to the management of our land here and our situation being reasonably close to the common, the commoners have approached us and asked us if we can help with the biodiversity of the common. So the horse is, um, we use him reasonably regularly around the land here. He's a fully trained cart horse and we're starting to introduce him to get him fit enough to start to roll bracken on, a, on an ongoing basis. As the bracken levels reduce so it's letting more light through and allowing other species to come through which then will give some feed for livestock and we can then introduce livestock and grazing onto the common and start to bring it back as into its historical use. The common is currently unfenced so there's an issue once we introduce livestock and grazing on the common that we're going to have to keep the stock in the areas that we want them and so we've been working with Caffili Council and the commoners to introduce a new system of geo-tracking of the animals which is essentially a collar. You can trace the animals on an app and you can also set up uh, perimeters uh, and you can trace where the animals are on your phone. So even though they're a little distance away on the common we can we'll know where, where they are It's exciting um, to start to work with the commoners and, and the local authority for, you know, really pioneering the, you know, our local common and working together and, and just to be part of it.